same level because you're saying we're not the bible too many times absolutely not you should read more of jeff groom's books over here no (laughs) he's not a a fan why don't you always have you on filthy dirty no (laughs) see this is you talk about power a lot she yeah 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 and she she, the power she has jeff and again i don't want her to get upset at anything because i like i really do like her she won't be upset but she is exactly why men hate women Nobody, she's, she's not. No, it's not, why men are jealous of women. It's not that they not hate like them. We're fucking jealous of women, Jeff. <laughs> we're Stop jealous that of fucking shit. Why are we jealous of women? Because <clears throat> of the power they have. It's not fair. <sighs> they have a power that we can't say compete what the po- with. Say, it doesn't matter how Jeff, handsome Jeff, a guy yeah, is. This go. power Jeff, doesn't compete. Say what the power is. Power of The power pussy. of beauty. She said it. The, Jeff, the, the say power, what the power is. The, it's the power whip. of beauty. Say what, say what, I'm out saying out it. The power of beauty is. is so powerful. Mm. It's always been that way throughout history. Men have made fools of themselves because of their power. Men have lost what, fucking what, kingdoms. What's They've the, lost what's the power, whatever you Jeff, can lose. Say what the power is. You want me to say the power of pussy? Yeah. It's That's the power fine. of okay. it's But it's the more power. than that. It's, no, it's, it's more than that. The essence of a woman. It's the power of beauty based on... And relative to what, Jeff? The idea, the vague idea that you may fuck them. Yeah, but that's the that's the end. Do you enjoy beauty that you're not even thinking about fucking? Do yeah. you just enjoy that? Yeah. Why don't you just watch? You know what? This ice cream sundays are beautiful sometimes. No, but to be to be in the presence of beauty. See, to me, okay. beauty is like a work of art. It's like going to a fucking museum, man. And you see, ladies beauty, and gentlemen, this is Jeff, this is Jeff Gurian, by the way. Uh, this is why he's here because <laughs> Jeff has a line of horseshit that is so righteous and so wonderful, and he believes it. I think I it's, believe it to the I core of my it being to be, go fuck yourself but we're at the same idea except for different language jeff you, here's the thing that i believe about you you have you have at least took that concept and you have i have lost the concept of patience jeff you took the concept of patience along with the concept of having a wonderful vocabulary and turned that into what i believe in we believe in the same thing. Absolutely. But I believe in it with less. I believe in it with a little less patience because I've been dealing with it that way my whole life. But I said, what the fuck? Because I just believe men to be better. I, you know what I mean? I just think that women don't have any concept about why men are better. And they just live that life because like like Pamela here, it you could just you could just see she's a lot of a lot of nothing for no reason like there's a lot of shit that she doesn't have to be but she is that and she's confused thinking that it's because she's magnanimous but she's really just a pretty bitch father time will stop that yeah yeah, but what i'm talking about it's the reason why beautiful women like to go to strip clubs because people like beauty People are drawn to beauty. Mm -hmm. Women, even if they're not gay, they like to look at other beautiful women. Absolutely. And I don't care how handsome a guy is or how ripped he is or what his abs look like. It's not the same thing. Why is it? People don't like looking at men. Why? I don't know. So you're saying women's beauty is different. It is different. Very different. And women have this innate power that they've used since the beginning of time. Fucking Eve probably did it to Adam. It's called called the the Uh, power of seduction. Power of seduction. But they don't even have to try. They just have to show up. In that power of seduction, there's also what you have to be a seductress. Not every woman should be the same kind of sedu- seductress. You understand what I'm saying? They're not. Meaning they don't have the same power, which is another frustrating part for me, is, like, I've seen a couple of ugly bitches in the street today, and I and I, I didn't talk to them, but I'm looking at them going, how come more ugly bitches aren't horny? Because like, they can't get laid. Meaning, how come more ugly bitches aren't like, give me any dick? <laughs> they have the same attitude as a beautiful bitch. Right. The they same laid. dismissive attitude in terms of rejection. Where mm-hmm. you go, listen, if I'm Brad Pitt, okay, I would take Brad Pitt's, or no, let me change that. I would take Brad Pitt's, like if a bitch couldn't fuck Brad Pitt, mm-hmm. if Brad Pitt goes, nah, come on, that's right. <laughs> yeah. I'm wise enough to go, I'll take Brad Pitt's throwaways. Bitches that Brad right. Pitt ain't fucking, I'll fuck. Right. There should be some bitches that go, all right, if LL ain't fucking me, 
I'ma fuck Patrice. This next nigga. <laughs> right, right. Well, it, it's, I'ma fuck this guy. But it's 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 because she doesn't really have to make that decision because it's it's our fault. Again, it goes back to our fault because so often. Just because this guy rejects him, how many guys are really going to... Re- a woman can always give away some pussy. See, that's she why I get frustrated with you, Jeff. Tell me why. Because you're not helping... Your... I believe... <laughs> Jeff is selfish. I, thank you. I believe your style is... It's it's selfish. It's, it's good for you. It's good for you, and you're not fucking helping with that... Mm-hmm. Beauty. It's like <laughs> no, because it's not, based in you truth. You have an intrinsic. Yeah, we most know, people we can't do that, what you do. You we have know an that, intrinsic though, anger. Huh? We know yes. that it's based in truth. It's, the point is that you're not. You're nobody can pull that off but you. That's and not true. There's the, other guys who probably very few, and the guys who see, try to the guys who try to pull it off like you. In order to pull it off like you, you have to understand the the basic fundamental when you boil it down to a rule, yes. to the rule of it, and and on you have to start that and hold then on, build. Hold on a second, this is something that you did that guys don't do, Jeff. When I asked you, listen, did you jerk off? Mm-hmm. Okay. When you was here's what I want from you. Yeah, I don't have to get it, but I want it. Yeah. I'm gonna push you till I get I'll it. I'll give you whatever you want. I no, have I don't no problem want. I don't that. want whatever. You, wh- I don't want whatever I want. I just want to try to get whatever I want. You do you, because that's why I love you. Because you do you. But I'm saying, uh, 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 visceral. Why it bugs me when you go, oh, the beauty and the boo. It it's the same horse shit that these fucking guys can't do it's it's like it's like you said it's the selfish thing it's for you but man shit it's based on anger of a certain degree no i get what you're saying you but jerking off is a very low level sexuality and i have worked the, it's, it's, the, <laughs> it's the lowest it's the lowest level of sexuality to please yourself yeah but it sounds the, fucked up yeah, it but, doesn't sound there's yeah, nothing hot about the, that that's the point that's the point this is why the I point is love this there's nothing hot about that when you if, if how you're, does anybody if you're, explain jerking off like this if you're into tantra <laughs> god love you nigga. Yeah, because if you're into tantra if you're using your sexuality to expand your consciousness right which is what i want to do i want to take sexuality to the highest levels uh, right? let, me, can I, let me interrupt. Okay. Oh, no. We're talking. We were talking about the time before before you knew tantric sex. Before that, we talking about in the very beginning. Maybe it was high school. I don't know. Was it high school? I always had a feeling for that. Yes, but I you didn't, didn't even know not, what it was. But, but we didn't under you didn't so understand did, so you that. You thought so jerking off was a low. You would have called and when you were sixteen, jerking off a low level sexual experience. No, I wouldn't then. have known what the fuck that was. That's no. what we're saying. That's what I've come to. It's like stepping back. Yeah. It's like it's like when you when you move to the city from the country, you can't go back to the country right, anymore. Right, right, but you once but, you, once but you, we're talking about fundamentally what it what did you do when you couldn't get pretty women? Jerk off is jerk the off answer. like everybody else. Right. Right. But Jeffrey. that's not what you said. Jeffrey, it was it Well, cuz it's an ugly thing. It doesn't feel Oh, like, Jeffrey, this is what you well, this is your new nickname for me. Wow. You are <laughs> the you are the passive misogynist. Passive misogynist. <laughs> yes, that's a good no, one. not yes. at all. No, you that, are that horseshit. I'm a gregarious isolator, <laughs> but I'm not a passive misogynist. Thank you. Horseshit. This is why. This is why. Nah, and I this is why I that. admire your shit. I just challenge it. Is that how you can mm. have Pamela in your life as a, per, as a as a as a person of access? She's gorgeous, but I know as a person of access, for me. It would either be we would fuck soon or we would never talk again because I would immediately challenge her. What I seem to think to be is horseshit. You See, don't. And it's 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 beautiful. You know why? Because if I'm with if I'm with a woman like her, I want her to come when she's with me. And if she doesn't know me well enough to trust me, she's not going to come. Exactly. Fair enough. Whatever okay. the fuck that means. Let's not get it well. Yeah. Well, she's gonna trust to me, then I'll tell her to shut the but fuck up and she talk too much. <laughs> I wanna And there's another thing too. I'll give you an example. <laughs> it happened today. There was gonna be a third girl here tonight. Yeah. I, I got into my elevator today and there was this girl I, I she was I was getting out and she was getting in, right? And I, f- I realized I forgot something, and I jumped back into the elevator. And this girl was really, really beautiful. She was, happened to be from Jamaica. Mm. And we're riding up, and I realized that nothing happens by accident. And I start, I have from the ground floor to the 16th floor to talk, right? Mm. you got to talk really quick. Maybe the 10th floor. 
Anyway, I had her within those few minutes to come on the radio with us tonight. She came to my apartment. This is a girl that I just met a few minutes ago. And while we were talking, I was telling her about the show. I wanted to prepare her that we're going to talk about sexuality and the difference between men and women and the power. I showed her Patrice. I told her about Dante. I told her the whole thing. And she said to me, you know why I came to your apartment? Because you have the kind of energy that I could trust. Because how does a girl that you just meet come to your house? And she said, She's because, a stinking ass bitch. She said, she said, and you know what she said? Because She's you, a funky hoe, Jeff. She and said, I'm not going to let her live her life with me letting her get off with being a funky hoe. Your style gives women like... Plausible deniability. Y- Beautiful, which is like, oh my god, I don't know what this I, is. Just, I it's feel magic. Aura. Why yeah, is my yeah. pussy wet? <laughs> it's magic. <laughs> I'm just gonna go, you funky bitch. Be a funky bitch. Yeah, and, but and he, I like you. I'm see. I'm doing a better justice for them because he, because I'm not <laughs> making them think that they're lesser or better because of their pussy. I'm mm-hmm. like, look, you a funky hoe. And, and that's then, okay. Let's hang out, bitch. And that's okay. I'm not, don't make me fucking go like and hoes. come down to your world of having to. I don't know what overcame. But you they have can a only, beautiful they, way of making hoes. No offense. Trusted. Yes, I. I, I <laughs> look at her open her fucking. Yeah. <laughs> baby, you see, I almost apologize right away. And to you, I don't know you. I'm not calling you a hoe. I'm not calling you a hoe. There's every but other I'm bitch saying, out there, right? Say that again. There's every other bitch out there. What are you talking about? You're not calling either one of us a hoe. Just every other bitch out there. No, no, like, no. talking about in a general, general, sense, in general, and a like general, a general sense, sense of what, what but it not is. saying. To any chick that she's a hoe, I'm saying under those circumstances, if a chick comes to my house that I just met and she starts saying to me, I'd rather not get pussy if she starts saying to me, there's something about you. (laughs) There's a a magical thing that's happening and it's twirling around and I see, yeah, bitch, you a hoe. I met you in the elevator. (laughs) Yeah, but that's okay. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You have to meet someone. Let's say she is a freak. You yes. gotta, you gotta give her. You have to make her comfortable enough to Why? be able to cop to that. Nigga, she's not gonna I do. just walk into your house She'll and tell never, you she's a freak. I do. I make them. You know why? But nobody can do I'm that a but piece you. Of shit. No, well, look so at I this. Because you're a master. You, I want to say. I want to. <laughs> I want to. You know, here's, here's you are the master pimp. Nobody no, can nigga, do that. He, you are the master pimp, <laughs> and you are the master. Do, do you see why? Yes. I am the. I'm kind of like the. We still bridge. didn't introduce everybody. The, I, yeah, Hold up. Let's step right, back. Let's, let's step uh, back for a second. Let me take a quick call real quick because this guy Bob. Bob, I'm sorry, dude. Bob. Yeah. I'm sorry about that, man. I, I'm going to try to get to these calls, but fucking Jeffrey, just unbelievable. He brought the perfect woman here. Perfect. <laughs> retarded and gorgeous at the same time. <laughs> but not mentally retarded, but just be- retarded and crippled uh. by her own loveliness. <laughs> she looks like one of these third world high porn, uh, these one of these, Beautiful, uh, beautifully disabled. These, these fucking Russian Beautiful porn disabled. stars. She's gorgeous. <laughs> She's beautifully she disabled. She doesn't say shit. I can't She's listen to it. She's in she doesn't, shock. I'm, I'm, I'm shock. absorbing all the self absorbency over here with you two guys and just trying to get a full grasp of how you can even make a woman come. Look at us. This is what I like. Yeah, That's you see that? You see how it's changing? Yeah, it's, I have, a little, I have it's a little less magical now. This no, is no, what no, I no, like, no, I'm just waiting for you guys. I'm wait, just wait, wait, What does Scarface say? <laughs> Keep it coming, baby. I like it. You, you, you got to look at your eye like you ain't been fucked in a year. I just got <laughs> fucked for 45 minutes, orgasm straight all the a way. A whole 45 minutes? 45 wow. minutes of a straight up orgasm. And, and who was this this breathing dildo that you <laughs> used that you pro- probably said, right there, right there. That's what I like. Do it there. Do it right there because that's how I come. If I fuck you, mm-hmm. I'm going to fuck you like I fuck you. And if you don't come, that's your fault. <laughs> it ain't that, my fault. But that's being self-absorbed, and that's no, it's why not. It's being given because being you. Gay. It's being giving. It's being gay. Because I'll find a spot gay. you never even knew about. That's and but see, you're doing. The only page, way that would happen is if you had a ten inch That's that's what. Well, I, I don't have that. Also, well, that's where you like it as well. Excuse me. Isn't it all right to say where you like it as well? Not just take it. These however, the guy gives it to you. Yes. Yes, because it trickles down from me. Never forget, beautiful, you are the fuck E all the time. No matter what you're doing, 
you're getting fucked. The fuck you can't really give directions. <laughs> Erections? Bob, Not what do you think about this? The other way you I'm sorry. What, what was your goddamn question, Bob? Because I'm, I'm just surrounded. <laughs> this, is, this is like WrestleMania, nigga. <laughs> You know, that, that's right. I, I'm going to make the statement I originally called for, but I have to tell you, you know, I, I don't know if Jeff believes it. He may be a good guy, but he is so full of shit. He's, 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 not, he's not full of shit. He's, and the thing is, he's not full of shit, Bob. He's not full of shit. It's like, I understand your emotions about it because I get the same emotions about Jeff. Yeah. But I know it's not full of shit. I'm envious it's of righteous. Jeff. It's, it's, it's a righteous that. thing, man. It really is. I Jeff is amazing. It, but he's got, <clears throat> he's got a penis gill. He doesn't want to pleasure himself. And he, and he takes the simplest of actions oh, yes, and reactions that women have. And he wants to mystify them and make them all these mysterious Which, hey, hey, but Bob, you know what? That's not a bad thing. But here's the thing that I say, always say, I say to Jeff is it doesn't help mankind. Your no. lack, your, it doesn't help Bob. It doesn't help me. It doesn't yeah. help Boogie. It helps you. It doesn't help the average man who can't well, grasp what he's got. Shut up. <laughs> now, who can grasp what other people are saying? <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, baby. Because you, you, she needs some medicine. I it's, like her. It's, 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 he is <clears throat> mystical. I mean, you're, I can understand what you're saying, but you can't. He's a level 12 pimp, and you, you, <laughs> you, he's, you're talking you guys are to like people. like level one and two. Oh, he's got an amazing aura about him. That's what attracts people oh, and beautiful sh- things. But man, because I, you can't I, get I, I, a, lot of, a lot of his status could end up in his own head. All right? Say that again. A lot of his own status and as what he's achieved and his level of etherical connectedness is all in his own head. Well, it's, 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 no, it's, no, it's, it's all in all our heads, to be honest with you. Can, you know <clears throat> it's all in all our... See, but you got to understand, though, Pamela. You, it, thank you, Bob. You got to understand, Pamela. See, this is one of the things that frustrate me a little bit about women also. L- you got to understand the anger of Bob. He was pretty what pissed. It, what it sounds like, you can't dismiss it. It's an underground anger that Jeffrey has had that underlying anger but he has worked through it worked through it with his concepts i have underlying anger and my anger is outward frustration it's still worked through it and, and i work through it yeah. with, with with a philosophical standpoint that i stand on it's not like i'm gonna choke a bitch i'm gonna punch him <laughs> it's more like shut the Let fuck me- up with your bullshit he has underlying anger that he worked through for his own style drew boogie you don't understand that because you've never had to work what, through. Let me ask you something. Where do you think his anger comes from? Where, where do you think Bob's anger comes from? Resentment. The fact that women, he doesn't get women. Exactly. At okay, all. He has probably yeah. has a small penis. That, see, why would you not? It doesn't have to be that. Why would have to be that? Most men. Why do you do that? It doesn't have to be about the yeah, kind of size. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. It's all about how you love and connect with the woman. Why do you do that? I guarantee she doesn't know. I'm and asking. Wait, wait, I'm wait, asking. Wait. I guarantee she doesn't know why she what, doesn't. No. What I mean. What doing that means. Means. Okay. That's right. It's like men Here's always judging you by you're the saying, size of your boobs. You're or saying that it, it, you're right. It does come from anger. Ask her what that means. Ask what does what that, that mean? mean? What does that mean? When Re- I'm saying why do you do question. that? When I'm saying why do you do that? Do you know what I'm talking about? When Re- I. Say, Re- I need, said, more, I need more roots. Where are you no, coming you from? Said, no, I, you said, I said, why do you think he's angry? You said, because he doesn't get women. And then you said, because he's probably he got to. Well, wait, no, let me finish. You, you asked me to explain it. You All said, right. let me. I, I, I said, you said, because he's angry and because <clears> he probably <throat> has a small penis. And I stopped you and I said, why do you do that? What am I talking about? What is that that I'm saying? Why are you doing that? Explaining to she what has, no. She doesn't no. even get it. Explain. She doesn't even get it. Isn't that Isn't that interesting? Now, this is what I know what the fuck he's talking about. I know what he's talking you about. You know what Absolutely. he's talking about. Absolutely. He knows what he's talking about, but she don't know what the fuck he means by that question, and, and she I doesn't would, even try to understand. I would think she would know. That's interesting I to me. I would not think. That's why I thought I would think she did it on purpose. I would think she did it on purpose. No, this it's, is it's, what it's, I mean when I when my anger is we both are going hmm you, I don't believe any woman immediately he didn't have to say that 
I know that she don't know what the fuck he's talking about. That's it. That's how I feel about it. What you did was you reduced men to penis size. <laughs> that's that's yeah, the standard that, that of a man. Is, that is penis size. Two and that's like saying that wrong. That's like judging is, women by the size of their boobs. The, all right, it is wrong, and you admit it because that, that was wrong and the reason why that. you're admitting it is because Jeff is what, so what and I'm smooth to say, about it, and he's got. Wait, let me finish. He's got this. He's got this beautiful aura, and so he can put it in a way that doesn't offend you. And you go, well, I, I shouldn't have done that. But what I'm saying to you, is, but you jump to that conclusion. I'm asking you not. Oh, so you understand what he's talking about, but I'm asking you, why did you do that? Why did you go there? Why did I go there with him? Why does he hate women the way he does? No. I'm assuming. That, no, right? she's still not getting it. Now you're, you're, you now you're, now you're, you're shifting I'm the plan. Call. I'm asking you a, sp- a specific. Let me ask another call. Let's, let's go it's back natural. to natural. Because we got a long show. She didn't have to think that's about why, it. It just came. It's right, natural. It came it's natural. natural. But that's this the point. Is, right. This is why. This is why I love her on this show already. Uh-huh. This is, she's perfect. <laughs> because this is... Well, it's an example of how women take away men's power. But men, men do the same fucking thing a lot of times. Listen this is to this. what I don't want. Jeff, I'm taking okay. another call because okay, you're ahead. frustrating me. I don't want. We no. have enough shit for their side of not understanding. It's not shit. about their side. But listen what to this. Walk into a club with a beautiful you girl. Is what you I'm walk into a club with a beautiful girl and see how other guys treat you. That they don't try to step on your territory so and start asking but that's the asking questions. Of what guys do. That's what but that's do. fucked and up. That's the it's because they're girl. jealous. No, but, no, but, no, but the not. thing is, if we a guy walks it, up I'm to you, if you're with a beautiful girl and a guy walks up to you and he says to you. Oh, she's really beautiful, yes. right in front of her. Yes. You take that as a compliment? Motherfuck right, yeah. nigga. No, Because then you know what that's like? That's like, oh, that's like no. he's, saying it, ready? he's I, saying it to your girl. He's, he's how, not saying it to you. Here's how I'm born I don't need down. a motherfucker Jeff, to tell me my Jeff, girl looks Jeff, good. Jeff, Jeff, I know she looks Jeff, good. Jeff, yeah. Jeff, really? Jeff, that offends Jeff, you. Jeff, Jeff fucking Jeff, offends me. Great. This is what it... Ready? What? This is how I look at it. This is how fucked up I am. Yeah. Jeff, hey, man, your glasses are wonderful. That's the same thing. Those blue Absolutely lenses. Absolutely not. Wait a minute. Because I don't how, own her. She's not a possession yes, of mine. Yes, she is. No, no. <laughs> and, 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 she's and, a, not a possession. She's an object of desire that has nothing to do with you. I don't need some strange That's motherfucker arrogance. to come and tell me that my girl yes, looks good. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yeah, but Jeff, I know she looks good because she wouldn't be with me if she didn't look good. Yeah, but Jeff, <laughs> I wouldn't be there. I wouldn't be there in the first place with her. I don't it need a strange guy. It, it Why do I need me. his compliment? It, it surprises me. Do you think me. that the woman chooses the guy? No. Say that again, beautiful. No. You don't think that the woman chooses no, the we guy? Set up, no, we set up the conditions that you choose us. No. We set up all the conditions no. that you choose us. <laughs> absolutely. Right. You are. Oh, we, got, absolutely. we got all the bait. We absolutely <clears throat> set up the conditions. We got so that all you, the bait. You, like, you don't, you, I mean, you may pick a guy at random that you find, a, a, mm-hmm. you know, attractive but all of those things that where where he is has this aura and he knows how to talk to you and those are all things that we've learned from from you, when we were me, when we me, our me, first inception on attraction from being women. rejected we, Jack, Jack, we, let me let me say what you do you choose but it's not a choose like we choose you choose it's almost an unsatisfying feeling your choice because you have to choose as if you're scratching a lottery ticket meaning you look at the you survey the land and go he's nice and your skill this is what I mean your skill is to stand there and go I'll get his attention so that he comes over with his skills because you have no skill to get a man your skill is your beauty you don't know how to get a dude. You don't know how to talk your way into nothing. You don't know how to talk your way into happiness. You never had to move and shake and talk and figure shit out and get rejected on a regular basis. You don't. That's not your existence. So, of course not. You don't choose a guy. A guy chooses you and you choose to go. I actually yes. did need to develop that because growing up, guys didn't date me. I don't know if it was the fact they were intimidated by me yes. or whatever. Yes. But they did not. You're date tall me. and beautiful. That's why they didn't date you. Because they couldn't come at you. That's why fat girls and ugly girls got boyfriends. Because guys come up to them with the proper, like, man shit. Confidence. They Confidence. come up to a fat bitch and go, hey, fat bitch. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not, they don't say that. But that's the, that's the aura they give out. That's the magic. They get out, they go, I, f- baby, come on. You ain't got no fight Options. against this shit. <laughs> Hey, what's up, ugly bitch or goofy looking bitch or oh wow, you got a cut on your forehead. Let me let me stare at that for a minute. 
and let you know that you ain't shit. Now I'm coming at you. But beautiful women, guys feel, and this is why beautiful women are heartbroken constantly, because guys come up to them with our worst aspect of getting a woman, which game. is yeah, lying. And we will lie mm -hmm. to get some. We will imply love to get some pussy. We will be lovable. To get some pussy. Loving. Hello, beautiful. Oh, my God. Hello, Pamela. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. You are... I know you hear this all the time. You're one of the most beautiful women I've seen all day. And I, and please, I, I've, I, I've seen a lot of women today. It's something so striking about you. Listen, Norfolk, can I buy you a drink? You don't... Niggas don't come up to you and go, God damn, look at that titty meat hanging out. What, <laughs> what, color, what color is your nipple, well, bitch? On both and, levels, <clears throat> though, on that first one, we also can tell if someone's, like, just... Instantly, as soon you, as I meet and someone, I can tell by their Of course, but you'll never. Let me tell you why women don't play chess. You play chess? Yes. Are you good? Of course Pretty not. Pretty decent. No, because you took too long, Jack. You're, you're not that good. <laughs> you play chess? <laughs> you don't play chess. <laughs> I'm going to tell you why chess, women don't play chess. Because chess is a consequence to that game. It's a game where Levels. you have to think 12 steps ahead. So you have to think, all right, if I say this. She's going to think that I'm doing this, but I'm really doing this. And I know she doesn't have five levels of thinking to my bullshit. She doesn't have to. Because I have 25 levels of bullshit. You don't have to have that. I think you have to do that because you have to get laid. So you try to think of all these different levels and stages and think ahead of women because you, that's have, not to, true. you have to cover up your bullshit 24-7. I, I have a girlfriend. That's, that's not necessarily true. Let's call true. her. That's not really Let's, true. You don't want to call her. Oh, no. You don't want to do that. <laughs> listen, oh, listen. Oh, oh. And Pamela, <laughs> see, this is why it's good you're here because your confidence level, I would never want to knock it down, but I do want to introduce the term of consequence to your life. Options. You don't, you've never, re you've really had to have a different way of thinking. You think that this is some old anger bullshit, this is some stuff that you can just uh, marginalize as just some fat angry dude. This is thought out shit, baby. This is, this is, I'm not on the radio because I'm just a raving lunatic. I'm telling you, <laughs> my girlfriend's gorgeous. She's a gorgeous bitch. Absolutely, but she, I've seen I know, her. I know of my girlfriend, she's abusive. And it's not of her fault. She's abusive because that's her nature, because women don't want to win. You want a winner. And that's what women test constantly. Is this nigga the winner that I think he is? So you come at us and try to make us losers. And what 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 a, a loser is, is a guy that lets his woman make his happiness because we don't know how to love. Men don't. I believe this. When we love a chick, we're actually copying what she does. We copy you. We go, uh, well, we go, well, I think women like to hold hands in the park. I think women like <laughs> to snuggle. I think really a well, man's that, love. That's, that's what the, 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 the righteousness of Jeff is because Jeff is really. No. Uh, he, he <laughs> does this, like this that stuff. motherfucker. He just, it. he just knows no, I, what he, they like. I but say, Jeff in his evil. Wait a minute, man. Jeff in his evil. In his ultimate evil, doesn't attach. I'm talking about a motherfucker that blows bu bubbles on his girl's stomach. <laughs> and I love you, booby. <laughs> he does that, but in the back of Jeff's mind, he's like, <laughs> I'm going to blow bubbles on this bitch's stomach, and she's going to go, <laughs> and he's going to go. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know, because I, I, you know You me, do the same but shit. But I'm not, but it's, I like women. I like. Nigga, I, I like, like them too. But you I like yours like, well no, done no, on a spit. That, you like yeah. <laughs> you want to put an apple in their mouth. Yeah. You want to put an apple in their mouth. You like to carve them up. Hold on, man. I like my women live. <laughs> we're going to throw... When I, when I eat them. We're going to throw a couple of... um. We're going to call a couple of... Couple of uh, there's some girls online. It was a girl, huh? Casey? No. Pamela? Pamela called him out after hung up. Okay, here we go. Pamela, Bob, Bob hung up. Wait, hey, is there. that Bob again? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, where was the, there was a 